Once you have Puget Bench for Lightroom Classic downloaded and unzipped, the first thing you want to do is go into the Benchmark Catalog folder and open the Benchmark Catalog file. Once Lightroom is open, you can load the Benchmark plugin by going to File, Plugin Manager, and clicking Add. Navigate to the Benchmark folder, select PugetBench.LR plugin, and then click the Select Folder button. After that, you can just click Done. Before you can actually run the benchmark, there is one setting you want to double check, and that's by going to the Develop module, selecting the Spot Remove, and you want to make sure it's set to Heal with the settings of 75, 0, and 100, just like this. If you have it set to different things, you will need to load a photo and then change these settings just to make sure that the benchmark is running it at the proper settings. After that is checked, you can actually run the benchmark by going up to File, Plugin Extras, and selecting Benchmark Run. There'll be one pop-up that just tells you about how long it's going to take to run, and then you can just wait for the results. One thing to note is that one of the very first things it has to do is create a whole bunch of copies of our test images. This can take a little while depending on the speed of your system, so you might not really see anything except for this progress bar at the top left for quite a while. Now, it'll only have to do this the very first time you run the benchmark. For extra runs after this, it won't have to regenerate these test images. When the benchmark is done, you will get this score screen that gives you the raw results, the average score for each of the tests, as well as an overall score and a score for the active and passive tasks. There's also system information at the bottom, like what CPU, GPU, and other specs you have in your system. These results are also saved into the benchmark plugin folder if you wish to share them.